Okay, so this is for my air signs, which are Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. So I did write three songs down for this month that you need to hear, um, which can be symbolic to you. So two of them are in Spanish, and one of them is in English. Um, even if you don't understand Spanish, you can still look it up. I feel like you would still kind of feel the vibes out of them. And I think you can look them up in English as well, either way. So, the first one that I got is Por Las Noches by Peso Pluma. And then MySpace by Don Omar and Wisi Andel. And then the third one is Mirror by Lil Wayne. So, <clears throat> what I do with this book is basically I channel uh, messages that you need to hear from your angels, your ancestors. Um, just stuff that you need to hear and know at the same time. Um, so the first one that I, I am getting is no speeding. <laughs> um, get more sleep. And then after I do this, I do like tarot. So this is just what your angels and your answers have to say. And then the second part is me actually doing tarot. So, <clears throat> excuse my nail, um, missing, by the way. Um, crying. Um, let go of your ex. Tattoos. So, either this person has tattoos or you're getting a new tattoo. Um, you're barely living life. Uh, crazy dreams, fighting, drama at the crib. <laughs> I'll put house, but you know me, I say crib. Um, I'm getting pregnancy or feel like you're pregnant. I'm hearing the bad already passed. Summer. So summer can be like, you're excited for summer or summer is where stuff will really kind of start. I guess you can say like heating up for you with love and money. Um, don't give up. Protect your energy. New car. Or wash your car. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm hearing the letters L, A, K, W, H, um, M, and E, and C. So this is going to be their first name, last name, middle, nickname. You put it where it resonates. All right, so now for tarot. Let's see. Let's see what they have to tell my Libras or more like my Geminis and my Aquariuses. More of my air signs. Let's see what they have to tell my air signs. So what they have to tell my air signs. Wow, this card literally flew out. So, um, either you guys can be dealing with an Aries or um, you're very in your emperor energy. Um, kind of like I'm the shit. And not really it's more of like the healed you isn't putting up with anybody's shit is what i'm getting like the healed you is like you know what i'm done or you're gonna be talking to an aries um that can be your ex or you're getting to know an aries so let's see Ooh, all the cards are gonna come out let me back this up a little bit so or you can be talking to an aries 
Okay, and I did get the judgment, um, which is basically you kind of seeing the real you. You're getting to know, like, <clears throat> basically, excuse my throat. You're, you're becoming like a new you. It's kind of like a rebirth in a way. Like, I'm going to be doing stuff that I like. I'm not going to be doing stuff that people like, you know? And with um, the Five of Cups in reverse, you're basically moving on. So, I feel like you did leave the past in the past. And you're focusing on you. Like, you know, new year, new me. Since we're still in that type of energy. Um, you're leaving the past in the past. The healed you. Someone's trying to basically um, yell at you or kind of tell you like oh well this and that and blah 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 you're kind of like wait what like i don't even care what you have to say like who is this right especially with the three of swords in reverse you know you're releasing pain you're releasing people that no longer serve you with it could be friends loved ones family members um also i feel like it's more of like an ex like i feel like you just let go of an ex so with the page of cups is you know you're finally not ignoring your intuition and you're finally saying like yeah like my intuition is right you <clears throat> are like basically finally putting your foot down and be like you know what no like i deserve way better like i don't care what anyone has to say like it's all about me now and then we did get the devil and also the wheel of fortune so i feel like this person um, which could be a fire sign or I'm getting like Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn vibes. Could be like your ex, boy or girl, doesn't matter. Um, this person is toxic as fuck. Like they want to see you not shine. They want to dim your light. But you do get the Wheel of Fortune. So you do have luck by your side. You can either have good luck with a position in work or you left a job to get another one. Um, <clears throat> um. Also, with that, um, with the toxic person, I just feel like it's just this person that's just always in a bad mood. They're always in a funk. Like, they're always this and that. Like, when they're in a good mood, they're in a good mood. But when they're in a bad mood, they're in a bad mood. And you're just tired of it. You're just like, dude, you're so wishy-washy. Like, make up your freaking mind. Like, it's either you're going to be, like, good to me or you're going to be bad to me. Like, they see you. It's like you're not there and they miss you. But when you're there, they're like, ugh, why are you here? Right? So I feel like you're finally ready to leave this person. Like, you're done. I'm, I'm done. Like, peace. Let's see what else. Let's sit though. So I did get the hermit. Let me see. Yeah. So I did get the hermit and also the page of swords. So I feel like you are doing a lot of soul searching, you know, kind of, like I said, putting your foot down. Um, But I just feel like you're barely living life like damn you're seeing like what you missed out on um i feel like you wouldn't really go out and now you're going out i feel like you wouldn't really want to dress up or kind of show off or do your makeup a certain way and now you really do um you do need to be patient though so say you did just get this new job and you want to move out um i get that but you just have to be a little bit patient like um like just because you you can't let your ego dictate your decisions in a way so just because you have all this money doesn't mean you'll have all this money by next week right so i did get the death card and also the seven of pentacles so with the uh, you could also be dealing with a scorpio or i am getting spiritual transformation so i feel like a lot of you guys are actually having a spiritual awakening or you guys are realizing that you guys are intuitive which is crazy um it's not a scary thing but i feel like it's a little bit overwhelming thing so maybe that's why you guys do feel that um, you don't want to be with this person anymore. It's kind of like if your body is rejecting the person. You know, your body's like, dude, like, what's next? Um, so hard work pays off with the Seven of Pentacles. So I feel like since if you do put in the work, obviously you're going to see stuff. If you don't do anything towards your goal, obviously you're not going to get any rewards. So also with the Four of Wands, I did get um, Happy Family. 
um, celebration. So you can be celebrating, you know, a new position in work. You can find out that you're pregnant, you're moving to a new place. Um, engagement as well. So I think a lot of you guys will be either having a baby um, <laughs> in summer or you guys can be finding out that you're pregnant in summer. And you guys are like, hell no, not me. Uh, don't look at me like that. <laughs> I actually saw this funny ass TikTok. Um, and it's basically saying, like, don't let him, like, you know, in you. Because um, summer's around the corner, which Loki made me freaking laugh because it's true. But if you're, like, with someone and you really want to be with someone, like, you're going to have the baby when it's meant to be, you know. Obviously, use precaution if you do not want to have a baby right now. Um, let's see what else. But some of you guys do really need to leave your ex. Like, the ex is is done so like this person's looking for you and you're just like dude like you're kind of like disgusted in a way like this person is not freaking happy they're like not realistic they just kind of want like just to bug like they just want to hold it like oh let me like she looks like she's doing good or it looks like he's doing good like let me just bug you know like they just like to hold it um so trouble you know lack of progress so basically with the six of swords i just feel like this person may want to do black to you and it's just not going to work out because we did get um the star so it can be an aquarius trying to do stuff to you or you can be an aquarius or you could be talking to an aquarius but they are getting their cards read about you for sure like they're going to two people it could be i feel like it's like a like a couple like, a couple can be going to someone and being, like, so... Like, the couple work together. Like, the spiritual people are, is a couple. And they could be, like, um, it's so like, what do you think? And, like, the couple can be telling them, like, just straight up lies, you know? Like, just straight up freaking lies. And telling them, like, yeah, you can get her back. Like, don't worry. But you can't. Like, you're done. Like, you're unhappy. You moved on. You left him. Like, you're done. 